Hello, and welcome to Pair OS 1.0 event, obviously. Now, with today we are going to be talking about Pair OS 1.0. So, let's talk about it. Now, Pair OS, we have been working with Windows to create a theme for Windows. But it's not, it isn't, it isn't as limited as a theme. So basically, we've changed everything, literally everything about it. Even the, like, sounds, notification sounds, um, wallpapers, um, speed, um, the cursor has slightly changed. So... It is actually, believe it or not, it is a lot faster. So, I'm going to screen record and show you Pair OS. Okay, so let's screen record. Okay, we're on Pair OS. You see this? This is real time. Like, this is like super fast and snappy. Let's somehow like hide it. Let's hide it down there so you can't see it. Now it is actually super fast. So let's go to this is one of the new sounds. So all of you developers know how, not developers, but coders know how, how slow PowerShell is. So what we're just going to type is in get. And so everyone knows this takes about 30 seconds to do, but look how snappy this is. Done. Super fast. Like, this isn't even a joke. And soon, in, in the Mobility Center, in a different update, it will be Pair OS um, 1.2. But look, your computer will either be on HP recommended if you've got a HP computer or whatever. But soon, in 1.2, if you click the arrow, there is Pair Pro Performance. Click that. Instantly, just close that. See how fast apps load. Yes, let's actually let's turn off run as administrator to show you how fast it actually is. Let's quit security advanced. No, it's not that one. Yeah. Okay, look how 
how fast this is. Done. And normally, this PC would, um, what would you call it? Um, it would, like, bug out on a 4K H DR 60 frames per second video, or just any 4K video. Look, if you click that, and the fans do start going, but pro that's only on pro performance. And the reason being is because pro performance is like super, like super fast. 4K. There you go. Oh yeah, that's enough of that before I get a copyright strike. Um, but it is actually mental. Wait, let's go back to um, uh, ink. Dot well, hello, not that idea. Let's go there. Alright, look how smooth these animations are. Mm -hmm. New, by the way. Like, boom. Boom. We're gonna go to 3 to 1 action. This is pretty cool. And let's go to D. YouTube. Oh, so I'm even gonna do a um, video editing demo. Um, okay. So we just click blank project. Um, just type in. Did you see how snappy that was? I literally had to click enter and it was done. Okay, so let's go here. Um, um, you've already, you guys have already seen this, haven't you? Um, let's see. Okay, then I'll just click the play button. This music title will be in the description, by the way. You can go and go to this. This is one of my favourite songs. Let's just go here. Okay, now let's split it about. Let's cut it about. There, just cut, cut that. Okay, that has been cut. Now, what do we want to do? What's that? Um, I don't actually know what that is. I'm gonna click that. Let's click. I think let's do colour balance, I think that is no I forgot where I put I forgot where colour balance is. Let's just click title no. Let's do colour balance on it. Crazy you can move it, just click this okay. Um, 
So that that one. Um, color balance. Just filters. Pixel. Yeah, that one. You can pick. That's how people get like the bad quality and then they like say, oh we've got big quality things. And it's actually just a pixelizer because you can actually control it. Um, let's see how long this takes to export the project. I only did it in 10. And look how fast this is. And can I just say this this is like a minute and a half normally to like, like this video is a minute and a half long. Normally doing a minute and a half long on um, Windows, I think it would take me about seven or eight minutes to export. But this is almost finished. When when I mean almost finished, I mean almost halfway. You can hear the fans spinning up. And this is just on pro performance. This is on pro performance. So the fans would spin. But pro performance doesn't have anything to do with speed. Uh, not speed, um, export time. Export time is just a thing that the app has that needs to be optimized to our software, which is nearly. Um, Optimized. Your conversion is completed. Do you want to upload to YouTube? No, because it's already uploaded. That was actually very, very fast. Job to save it. No, but that was so, so incredibly fast. Let's cut back to the camera. Wasn't that so incredibly fast? It was, wasn't it? Now this has been a long event. Well, when I mean has been, I mean I think we're only like quarter way through. Because there is a lot of other stuff. So we are going to download some stuff and upload some stuff just to show you how fast this machine. This isn't even like, hasn't even got like, I mean it has got a really good Intel chip in it. But it's not like the best. I think it's like a Core i5 8th gen, 7th gen, 8th gen. And it's not even the most powerful core, uh, most powerful processor. So if you've got like a, like a really powerful processor, that is going to be absolutely crazy on your computer. Um, so let's go and upload some stuff. Okay, let's hide that again. Because <laughs> it always shows up. Like, look, like, there's no lag. Normally there would be lag, but there's literally no lag. So let's go hide this in the corner. And the double click is impressively fast. See this wallpaper? Now we are going to, in fact, render it. And then we'll get to the download and upload part of this video. This is like no lag at all. And this normally lags, literally. When I mean normally, I mean all the time. Like, but it's not lagging at all, and the fans even aren't even spinning that fast. Like this is 3D rendering. This is how I got it done. I just camera. Okay, now let's just click, click render, render image. Not this took about 10 minutes on my, on Windows. Well, Windows without. Look, see, done. 10 minutes compared to like. 15 seconds, but like, look how fast that's smooth. It, like, look how smooth it is. And that's a bit laggy. But, like, look how fast the zooming. Zoom, zoom. Pretty fast. Now, let's get to download and upload. Um.
no, I don't want to. Now let's get to the download part. Now let's download a video. Let's download the recap video. But look, look how like, uh, that's on the playlist. I don't want to go to the playlist to go back to content. But like, look how snappy this all is. Um, recap. Done. That was like really fast. Now that's done. Now let's just click create. We're gonna upload a video. Um, select files. This isn't gonna go public. This is just going to be... Oh, yeah, that's all the videos from the event. Um, recap. And... Okay, three, two, one, recap. Yeah. Oh. But now just click upload for setting 90. Look, look, it literally just went to 99%. Like, that is, I know it's only 33 seconds, but that is quick. Finished. Wow. Boom. So, that was at download and upload speed. Now that um, should we do next for speed? Um, we've done 3D rendering, we've done video editing, um, Visual Studio, we could do that. The Pair Search app. I mean, this is slow, but it's not as slow as Windows. Sorry, I was yawning. Um, but it's not as slow as Windows. Surprised Windows doesn't even let me do this because it's faster than them. But look, like, still like this. It's, this bit is laggy. I would expect that to be like, like it is laggy because it's like a really, really high um, performance thing. But with Windows, you'll normally be dragging it. You drag it over there, the cursor's still there, and then it will move. But, like, the cursor is still there. Let's just click Start. Now, oh look! Like, this is fast. This is Perfect app Beta. Um, but we can check the performance of this app. There, look, see? On um, Windows, I think it was running about 200, but now it's running 90. Process memory, okay. Look, let's type in. Oh my gosh, what is wrong with me today? I mean, it's going to jump up extremely high. Let's see. It's still not as high as Windows. I think that was running about 3... No, 280? Now it's running the one. Now let's just click images. Now I know the images one is going to have a big jump. Yeah. That's... Okay, let's just type in bunch of stuff. Let's see if the memory goes like. Oh, the memory just went cavazzle. But, but like, it is very high performance. 
So it's very power efficient as well. That's if you have, if you don't have Pro Performance. Like I said, Pro Performance is meant for video editing, rendering, and stuff like that. Um, and it also helps with 4K videos. And believe it or not, it works with 8K. No lag. I've ha I've tried it. Um, I've tried exporting an 8K video, and it. Well, it took about an hour, which is expected, because it is 8K, and not every processor is fully adapted for 8K. But it did export it. And it was HDR, so pretty good. So, I have no idea how long this event is. I think it's about 20 minutes. Yeah, about 20 minutes. Um, so... The Power OS, I think this might be a big success. Maybe, I don't know. Let's just find out. Um, but Windows, being serious now. When the heck are you going to upgrade from Windows 10 to Windows 11? We've had Windows 10 for about... Uh, five, almost five, year, five to six years now. Yeah, almost six years. So, Windows. Please upgrade your Windows system. Although I'm not going to use it because I'm, I am. No, no joke, I've been on this Pair OS thing for about two weeks. Yeah, it's about two weeks. Um, I will say, I think the biggest update is going to be. And I shouldn't really be giving this away. Well, technically, the Pair OS 2.0 will be an update technically but an update will still be OS 1.1 or OS 1.2 so I think the biggest one out of the OS 1 or I don't, I don't actually know how the naming is going to go it might just go from uh, OS 1.0 to OS 1.2.0 uh, so I might just got, get rid of the dot zero. so no idea So it is a thing. Okay, let's switch back to the camera. Okay, that was Pair OS. It's actually quite amazing and power efficient and performance is great. Can't wait until that um, 1.2 or even OS 2 or I have no idea what the naming thing is going to be at the moment. So, the full version, it's in beta at the moment, but the full version will be hopefully available next week. Because it has been in private beta just to me at the moment for like two weeks. Hopefully the final version will be next week. Don't know, maybe between now and two to three weeks ahead. So, um, I think this has been the longest pair event since thing so yeah the power is like amazing if you want to download the beta yes the beta without member sign uh, without member members the little without membership sign in um a link in the description to download the beta right now 1.0 but the full version i have a feeling it won't be dot 1.1 1.2 i think it will just be pair os 1 pair os 2 and we might not we might even change the number to a name, like a place. So, who knows? Places anywhere in the world. Maybe OS London. No, I'm joking. Um, I don't know. Although I've got three weeks to decide. That's quite a while. So, download the beta and get ready for the pair search event, which. I also shouldn't be giving this information out. I'm going to anyway because it's 2021. Who cares? We're stuck inside. <laughs> Who cares? Um, it's called pair. No, it's not. It's called ser. No, what am I doing? It's called beyond searchable. So that'll be coming soon. So I'm so excited for the final version. 
like I said, it might not even be a number, it might be a place, it might be an animal, or it could literally just be called Pear OS 2021, or Pear OS 2022. But at the moment, it's called Pear OS 1.0. So, the, the name and strategy will be in the commercial in a few weeks, or maybe even next week, maybe even tomorrow. Who knows? I do, but who knows? No, I don't know. Um, but anyway, thanks for watching. Bye. Get ready for Be Unsearchable. Oh my gosh, this has been really, really long, this video. But anyway, my channel's verifi verified, so I can go longer than, like, I think it's long, I can go longer than 15 minutes now. So before I could only do 15 minutes, which I've never uploaded a 15 minute video on my old channel. No, actually I have. I think I've uploaded like a 30 minute video. But that was like a live video with the dog, I think. I, I'll put a link in the description for that as well. Goodbye and get ready for Beyond Searchable. Bye bye.